more than a 10 or 12 by 12. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Welcome. Good morning. Hi, Leah. Hello, Diana. Hello, Hello Leah. Aaron. Welcome. Hi, Aaron. Hi, Leah. Hi, Diane. No, sweetheart. I'm sorry. I just can't call her anything but sweetheart. <laughs> I know Sean has given me strict orders that it's sweetheart at all yes. times. I just, it seems wrong for me to call her that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just, you know. Yeah. She's never going to be Diana again. Oh, sweetheart. No. Well, we used to have three or four Dianes and Dianas in there and it got really confusing. So it was nice when we when they came up with a sweetheart and threw it out there i could keep track of who was who so much better that sweetheart was first yes then we and got then a couple more after that who else diane doubles zero uh, seven double oh seven she yep. was there diane did some burger it yes. got really confusing there for it we had three or four uh, that were a lot of them in at the same time and I was new. I was scared I'd invoice the wrong thing to the wrong person. But um, I did that with the Pams. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If I did, they were gracious enough not to call me on it. <laughs> I don't know. I may have. All right. We're deconstructing. I cheated a little. We can see that. Yes, look, look how she's even laying it. Talk about cheat. <laughs> I can't help it. Jill, I'll never get the cover put back. Yeah, I know. I'll never get it put back if I do it. Jill, like, you have a cheater picture. I do. I've got two cheater pictures. So this is good. Okay. Oh, God. You said Diana. They only call me sweetheart. Okay. So, sweetheart, you are a gamer, too. What games do you play? Oh, this one crumbles so easily. She and I play one. You're a gamer? I don't game like that. She and I play... What is the name of it? I don't care what you got today, Bliss. Oh, God, I didn't want that either. We play Word Blitz. Diane and I. And right now she's kicking my butt again. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Last two games she has, or three, two or three, I'm not sure which, really kicked my butt. But that's okay. I'm not. Um, God, I wish I cheated more. There. Did you see her answer? Yeah. She said she mm -hmm. only mods now mostly because she, she used to play. Okay. Huh. I just, that's the only game I play. Is the word blitz? I'm moving around, guys. I still can hear you. I forgot something very important. Oh my, she forgot something. Yeah. Uh -oh. How could you tell with that cheater pile of stuff? <laughs> yes. I know what she forgot. I can see on her desk. She doesn't have a paintbrush, nor does she have glue. Um, she's going to use matte gel medium, I thought, but I don't okay. know. I'm See, there you go. I'm not making a cover, even though that's mm. kind of what it looks like I'm doing, I guess. What are you what are you playing with then? I'm going to use this, I think, as a cover, but this is the a tapestry, and it probably should be used for a carpet bagger oh, as God. opposed to just a journal. And I've never made a carpet bagger, so oh, that's God. what I wanted it for when I got it. And I'm not sure this is the photo that I want to use. So we're just kind of we're here today to play, aren't we? Yes, just playing. I needed to put journal covers together and have them ready to go. So that's what I'm doing. 
Jill's yeah. holding together um, her journal. Paula is playing with hers. So it's just kind of a let's chat and crack together. We do that a lot anyway. We do. <coughs> I decided we did that just a few hours ago. Yeah, it was. All sorts of stuff. Yes, but you do were crafting. I, I wasn't. I was cheating on the cover. If I was supposed to start from scratch, which there are no rules, I would be a cheater. But I, there are no rules, so I technically did not. I think we're going to have to do a challenge like Kara Brandon does on her channel. Have you guys seen that? No. They do this fun little challenge thing where they have categories and someone spins a wheel and... No. They have a timer. Oh, and I panic. <laughs> I panic. I'd never be able to do it. You saw how much I pre-planned this. Hey, Paper Rooster. Good oh, morning, Wendy. Wendy. Did yes. you see all this chat here? Sweetheart is telling you that she usually mods for her kids, her guys. Um, then she started talking a foreign language. No, then she started telling you that that she and I do play the word blitz, but we used to play W O W, which I don't know it, what that is. C O D is that call of the call of season? duty? I don't know. I didn't. I'm trying to use the right word without getting it as a bad word. All sorts of stuff. They just so started playing Rust again and Saul and Skill, Skull and Bones on the PS5. I think COD is Call of Duty because my son plays that. Okay. This was the foreign language we were talking about here. Russ, I have no clue or skull and bones. No. Aaron, that is on our to watch list. Are you watching it now? War, World of Warcraft. Okay, see. My son's as old as some of these women in the chat. Yeah. Uh, I think he's my age. Um, a little younger. Oh, that's right. He is. Yes. Yes. Kind of he just turned 52, you. right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. My son's. Right. 43. Yeah, he's more my sister's age. Okay, there we go. My kids are 48 and 45. 48 and 25 or 30? 45. They're three years apart. Okay. 48 okay. and 45. Oh, oh man. I'm hoping to get to see the youngest tomorrow. He's not got back to me. Jill? I told him I, told him I was cooking homemade rolls. He's, he's really thinking hard. <laughs> Patience, Jill. <laughs> if I feed him, I know he's coming. <laughs> and then she's going to be disappointed because Wendy's asking, how are you, Jill? I'm good. Thanks, Wendy. Oh, no, I'm so sorry. Anything to do with taxes makes my head explode before I even start doing any of it. I can imagine, Wendy. She said she just finished mom's taxes. Head oh, is ready Lord. to explode. Yeah. When they're done that, know that. Oh. Yeah, I got left with all that. It was fun. Yeah, we got audited this year, so. Oh, oh yeah. That's we had to too. make yeah. copies and send it in and. They're like, we only want your top five. I'm like, you're getting it all. Oh, no. You want me to make copies? I'm sending it all. I'm not sorting this stuff. Oh, Leah B will be 50 next week. Happy early birthday, Leah. Yeah. Yeah. I'm terrible. I can remember it the month before you tell me, and then I can't remember it that month. I have three birthdays Welcome. in April. I'm trying to think. I've got three or four, I think, myself. I have three. You've got babies, so mine are all old people like me. Well, hang on. 
my husband is not a baby. Yeah, he, he's not. We don't class it well. I don't know. Mine is sometimes. But well, when mine's he sick, he can be, but he's not sick. So let's he's just a, let it go with that. He's a good man. I'm not mine's been a big baby. <laughs> oh, Sean, I know she lies about you, doesn't she, honey? God Never. <laughs> Never. I never yes, heard a Jasper. mean word come out of that guy's mouth. <laughs> Not Unless yet. Talking to me. No. Yeah, he was so pleasant to me last night. Right? Yes. I'd be frightened. <laughs> if he was pleasant to me, I'd be scared what he was up to. <laughs> oh, I hate this map medium stuff. I get it everywhere. <laughs> Jill, it's okay. But no, most people would put, you know, something on their table besides a doily. This is a tablecloth. It washes well. Thank yes, God. sweetheart. So he is not going to join me in the morning um, because he is doing things with his family this weekend for their birthday and Easter. That's so, nice. Yes. I'm here. Give me that. I think fact. Casey and his brother turned 33. Oh, babies. They are they are babies. Baby babies. I wouldn't mind trying 32 over again, knowing oh, what no, I know no, no, now. No, no, no. I, I have to have knowledge from <sighs> Jill. Don't forget your thumbs up. I did it. Yeah. In fact, I did it on my phone and on this, and it let me do both. So, <laughs> Hi, Jasper. I'm trying to glue and watch chat, and I'm not doing very well with either one. Yuck. Wendy Candy is hanging in there. She's got, um, she's got some issues that have come up with having surgery again. Um, she's diabetic and insipidus is that right jill did i say it right i think so i've heard it called several different but we know what you mean yep yeah so her her water intake her body was keeping up with the output but now it's not so it's elevated her sodium levels so we have some more swelling going on um you know Just hormone so issues Mood swings, bipolar. I'm kidding. I hate that. The mood swing thing is ugly. Okay, I still didn't decide about that, but I can decide that later. You don't have to finish it. Jasper, um, Jill, hallucinations by Jill C, correct? Yes, Hallucinations by Jill C. Um, she is with us. And then Paula. What is your site, Paula? Um, Paula Fowler Creative Treasures. There we go. Creative Treasures 04 is her email. Don't forget it. 04. If you need to contact her. She does have, have some amazing advice. Just they might want to call and chat, Polly. You never know. Oh, yes. <laughs> These don't match. There's she will be having problems. some um, oh, fabulous... Are you, are you going to do your box? Are you going to sell know. boxes soon, Paula? Yes. I My hesitancy in saying yes is I... I have one doctor's appointment this week. One was canceled. Then the next week, I think I have. Oh, God. I don't know if I have one or two. But then I see the surgeon again for my eyes, cataracts. Um, When? I don't know. In April as well. So I'm just not real. And no, but Jill nor I have either one sent out invoices for the yes. last deal we had. Good morning, Judy. And the Hi, reason we, I didn't and she hasn't is for the same thing. Your shipping costs are not worth 
the price of the package and there's still space. So we felt that we would hold on to those items um, and let you contact us and tell us you need it before, then we'll do it. But I need it, I need it. Then I'll, of course I'll send. Yes, but my, I mean, for my particular items, we're talking ounces for most people's boxes. So, and you, you know, know, they charge you for those ounces. <laughs> I mean, I can put them in bags, but that doesn't change the shipping. So <laughs> not much. Not enough to, so that's why I have not. Well, maybe this would look good, although I kind of like that. Wow. This is hard. I'm not being able to see what you two are doing. Why? Because I've got my nose stuck in the matte medium stuff. I'm just gluing my flaps down on my envelopes. I'm just playing. And then oh. I'll pull out the fabric. <laughs> see, this is what I always do last. This is really hard. Yeah. Doing this first. She said something about challenging us, and she's going to time us, ladies. I said she's crazy. I know she's not challenging me. <laughs> I'm challenged just thinking about it. I'm having an apoplectic attack. No. Oh, my God. She scared me. I'm doing a Woodsy Owl Journal. Hi, Deanna. Glad to see you. Hello, Deanna. How is your husband? Hi, Deanna. All right. Then. No, I don't want that shade of pink either. No, I have to paint the other side. Dang it. Pink up there, but not that color. We need more of these. Well, you should have plenty of those. <laughs> hey, Brenda. Hi. Brenda's here, Lindy. Hello, Brenda. Hi, Brenda. Oh, I wasn't you know sure. What? I don't have any more of those. Which ones? This one. Do I have any of those? Um, I don't think so. Nope. Yeah, Paula's on the bottom, Jasper. Hi, Janine. Yeah. Glad you could make it. Good morning, Janine. Hello, Miss Janine. Janine, I want you to take this in the spirit given. I hate going to sales with you because you and I like the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> fight. God. I do not I do not cuss at you. I promise I do not say bad things other than darn it, Janine, stop it. <laughs> so if you see me bidding against you, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> and she's oh doing the God. same to us. I'm sure she is one. Dang it, Jill, go back home and stay away. <laughs> so I could shop for her, and I swear she could shop for me, and there wouldn't be a whole lot of missed tips in it. Oh, man. Talk about weird. <laughs> yes, yeah, she definitely likes what we like. Oh. Well, she's diversified. She likes the... Uh, critter things she does. so so she and i really have a time she on. likes the lace she likes the fabric she likes yeah. the quilt squares she's like she likes, me that. Yeah. She likes yeah. paper i okay, think that I need... we all have some of that in common it's just oh, a matter yeah. of you know what you pick i need that owl book cover take a picture of that and mail it to me <laughs> That's what inspired me to do this cover, Janine, was that owl book you got from, I think, Rebecca. Not sure. Pretty sure. And I thought, oh, man, I need that picture. <laughs> that was a drop dead gorgeous. So I've got the book ordered. Thank you so much. It was gorgeous. I missed that sale. I did, too. I had to go to Evansville that day, but I rewatched. She had some decent books that day, didn't she? Oh, man. Of course, I'm a book freak. What are you going to do with the owl on the front, Janine? <laughs> Cover it up. Oh, no. <laughs> Jill, I had to say that. 
It is gorgeous. Yeah, you knew I'd have another apoplectic spell. Yep. <laughs> I have no idea what up. she's doing with it. Somebody was cutting something up the other day, and I thought, oh, my God, oh my God can I save it? They've already got it. I don't think I can get it away from them. Jasper, today is Casey's birthday, so he is doing family time this weekend. Good morning, Brenda. Oh, my goodness. Sakes. Brenda, do you and Sweetheart or Sweetheart, do you and Brenda play Word Blitz? I know you both do because I played with you, but play with you both. But I didn't know if you played against each other or with each other or however you want to word it. Yes, yeah. phrase that properly. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, thank goodness Sean's not here. We're going to keep it clean for a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> for a few minutes. Well, he'll catch I'm not later. saying nothing wrong. Not yet. yet. <laughs> oh, stop it. <laughs> I love you too, Jill. Uh, yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> Why did you put it on me? So they well, can see what you're doing. Oh, good. Now I can. Oh, my God. I love that upholstery. That's it. It's pretty. I know. Oh, my God. It has a lot to still go. You know, I like that texture. Oh, you can see those rows. Those flowers just pop. You put Which pearls one? on there in sequins, right? Pearls at least. Um, I got to figure out how to cover the edge of this, but the bottom of it has um, the. Oh, yeah, um, you don't want to cover that. Yeah. No. I, no, I'd want that. And I'm thinking about making it a flip since the back is beautiful. Yes. I mean, it's got that. I don't like the red, but the truth is, it. This is a ready color in some of these flowers. I started to say, usually there's a burgundy ready thing in those because well, that's the ones I'm drawn to. This is, um, Jill, I got this fabric from you. I know. Okay. <laughs> I thought so. Paula, if you, well, you did see, I started to say, if you've just seen what all, but you did see what I was going through. <laughs> and I knew you would use it before I would. Well, I really, like I said, it should make a carpet bagger, but I've never made one. We'll see. Couldn't. I mean, just because I'm playing this way doesn't mean that anything. I'm trying to do things outside my comfort zone, but I'm really having trouble with it. You're getting there. I am, am going to do that romance kit thing from Wendy, though, the one we got. Which we both one? got one of the kits. The reds, and I can't do reds. So I don't need, know what yeah. it's got poppies on it. Yep. It, it's a red. Know. Reds and blacks. So I can do the black. It's not really true well. reds, though, Jill. That would I couldn't do it if it was true reds. I would be lost. It's not a red blue. It's a red. Eh, I hate to say red orange, but it's in that. It's, it's got more of that texture or that color family. So we both got a kit and we're going to do them and see who, well, how different they are because our styles are so different. Now I want to know how many Yay. pieces. I'll put it there so you can see. Just who saved these pieces of lace? Put it back on all of us, please. I do. I may Janine. part with it. <laughs> Janine, if you get rid of the owl book, you just call me. <laughs> Agree. I do like the poppy, Jasper. Linda said she doesn't gain, or they said they didn't game together anymore. Did Becca quit, you said? I was reading chat, and then I got engrossed again, dear God. Okay, now I'm done. I have to let it dry. Okay, I got another cover. Not a problem. Brenda's been beating my butt the last couple days. She has. Uh-oh. She may part with it, she said. I know. I told her, just get a hold of me. <laughs> I save every thing for snip. I've got a little box on the corner of my desk. Okay, when so I everybody says that. I'm sorry, Diane. I didn't quit. I started a new one this morning. You can keep beating my butt. I don't care. <laughs> you don't care? Diane. I don't, because I enjoy playing the game. I like to play games that are Dang, not, 
I like the spelling games. It, it, you know, attempts to broaden my horizon. Ha, ha, ha. But I do enjoy those. I like the word games. There you go. That's what I'm trying to think of. Yes. I'm, I'm going to be down to play some word games. I like those. I think I would. I'm just not much of a... I sent her one. She, the, I sent her the one that I play with Diane and Brenda, but... Did I don't you think know I, what she said to me? Hmm. I don't play games. Hey. <laughs> well, well, it's no. true. Her comment was, I don't play games because I don't sit still. That is true, too. That was her comment. So, I'm, I a, didn't wiggle. It. I'm a wiggle wart. I like to do the... I'm, I mean, I'm not a I'm good not, speller. I'm a pretty I'm, good speller. You used no, to be, a <laughs> but I haven't, you know, you don't have to spell anymore because your phone does it for you. I Only when I want it not to. You've ever yeah. seen it fail? Yeah. Okay. We're going to work on another book cover because that one's got to dry. Oh, geez, Louise. Poor thing. I know. I hate it because I was dying to do this one, too. <laughs> All right. What do I need? Oh God, that's so. Or my two just kind of land. You know I suck at this. Oh, Janine likes Scrabble. Mm. I used to play that a lot. You know, never nobody ever wants to play Scrabble with me. Or when we did the board games back, you know, in the Stone Age. I like Scrabble. I like Scrabble. But I like stuff like that that challenges me. <laughs> Which is just about any game you want to name anymore. Paula says, I'm not getting Alzheimer's. I'm getting dementia. <laughs> Thank you so much. It was true in the moment. <laughs> oh God. The moment I said it, it was. It could have been possible, you thought. Well, I have to play Scrabble together on... That would be fun. I don't know much about playing online, but I'd love to learn. So, hey, I got my new computer and I got it set up. And then, guess what? I'm on today. My laptop. She got a new phone. <laughs> guess what phone she's using? No, no, no. I, still have, to use, I have to use the new one because the old one won't do anything. Nothing. No picture. No nothing. She can't even get Messenger up on it. Okay, I guys. Not on my new computer. I'm not so on our challenged. new phone either. Hey, I got Messenger on my phone. I did that. So why can't I get it on the computer? Duh, I don't know. You didn't go where I sent you last night. Did no, you? I did not because I was doing That's ephemera. why you can't do it. The ephemera. For well, Lindsay sends you a link and you ignore it. I, I screwed it up too. <laughs> I mean, you know, work for me. I don't know why. No, it's an operator error, guys. <laughs> no, I got on and I thought, I'm just going to go on in. So I went in and I touched it and it took me to my email, my dream yard. And I'm going, okay, this has got to be me. Well, I got my new phone doing during our sale, sweetheart, the other day. So then I was too tired to do much with it. But then I called and got it set up. I'm still fighting with them. I, I God, it was a mess. Judy, what did they say when you called them? <laughs> I love you, Judy. I was at that. Oh. People don't like to be corrected, even if they're in the wrong. Have you noticed that? <laughs> We're learning from those entitled children. I'm like, hello. Yes. That's been taught by their entitled parents. Well, you know what's really bad is. I just say, excuse me. I'm sorry. I'm in the store. I bump you. Excuse me. I'm in the store. I want to get by. Excuse me. Yeah. But holy Jiminy crickets. Not nowadays. It doesn't work well. No, it doesn't. You get these looks like, excuse you. You're right. Wait your turn. I All I want to do is grab a box of cereal, you know, that I can't reach anyway. So, Judy Dang. said, said they were kind of stunned, but said thanks. 
Well, you know, people think you're an idiot if you can't. I'm the world's worst to type. And before I double check carefully, I hit what that about, send. What yep. about your and your, Jasper? Oh, yeah. Y-O-U-R and Y-O-U apostrophe R-E. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes, that drives me nuts at work. They'll say, you're welcome. Y-O-U-R. And I said, how about Y-O-U apostrophe R-E? Or how about you don't use words that have to have apostrophes and then we're good. <laughs> That's what I told somebody one day. I said, if you can't spell the apostrophe, yeah, please just don't use it. I caught myself. I wanted to do now the other day and I wrote I, I typed no I just you know I'm like God Jill this is your pet peeve and look what you're doing here. Well don't look at mine for correct grammar. Punctuation is not my thing. It always has been but my computer keyboard and I do not get along so you might not get caps or punctuation. I usually get something that I can't read. Yeah that's where you have to have the decoder ring. Well, it doesn't always work. Sometimes it's, you get question marks back. <laughs> and I'm like, read between the lines. Get your decoder ring out. It didn't work. I tried. <laughs> she, she says it was a bomb on this one. Criminently. Maybe I'll put that one up there. Now, should have and should of. Yep. I feel your pain. I would have majored in music and minored in English. So my family didn't. Uh, and they hated when they did something stupid that I knew they were more educated to not have to do it that way. How am uh, I going to open that with this here? I'm not. You're, the brain, you're the brains. Tell me what you think. I just may have to lose the back. Oh, oh that's bad. Well, you know what? You don't get it all all the time. Maybe you do. I don't. I still want it though, so doesn't stop me from Read wanting. fabric sample books at the Goodwill, Janine. Wow. Yes, you have a sale to sell. Yeah. Erin, <laughs> how many times have I done that? <laughs> sell or sale. I probably do it all the time. I think you I do too. Understand. And then after I send it, I'm like, well, well shit. Now what have I done? <laughs> but you know what? It's okay. My new keyboard and I are already friends. Now, if I can just get a couple more things put on there. I put everything on there I wanted, but I'm having fits with Messenger, and I'm just I'm afraid to go back for fear I'll smash my beautiful new screen. <sighs> She's God, not going to smash it. That's not her personality. No, not really. I want to be that way sometimes. I want to be meaner. You so may want to be, but you're not. I'm not, not. Sadly, they told me at work, I'm just not able to pull off the gruff, austere, stern, pay attention to me person. And I wanted to a couple of times. Really bad. Okay, ladies, what are we going to do with this? We uh, can't see it. God, I love it. Put it on her for a minute, Jill. Or Lindy, please. This is going to be a medieval mirage. Oh. See, yeah. never mind. I almost caught myself. It's got blues in it. But I may end up covering the whole thing. I hope so. <laughs> hey. You don't like the grungy, I know. But I, it's I, not I, the grungy, not Jill. That looks like a sticker that was left on the top that you didn't take off. Well, I'm thinking some pretty lace will cover that. I just got to get some stuff. I wasn't planning on even looking at this one. I wasn't thinking or I'd have cheated and glued that last night. I told you what to do. I know, but I didn't. Grab your about paper it. bags and do just what Lindy's doing. I think I used them all for those purses. I don't think I've replaced them. Uh -oh. You okay, know how to do that. Cleaned up. We'll just pull those papers back out. Now nah, that's too hard for me. I have to really concentrate. Okay, where's my quilt? I have a piece of quilt I wanted to play with. Is this it too is flat? Put it back on all of us, Lindy. We're just working you to death. Sorry. So 
those I states. Oh, sweet are them's fighting words. <laughs> I'm from an I state, which pretty much has proven your theory, sadly. <laughs> oh my God. So I have an accent. <laughs> Put have it on you, own. Lindy, so we can see. Is this yes. too flat, ladies? I don't think so. You got texture with the lace. You've got the texture. I, I love the flowers. And that bottom is pretty. Well, lace I don't know how lace. long it'll be to put more here, but. Yeah, it needs more at the bottom for sure, I think. But that's, a, do you like it? That's what you asked me. I know. I know. Yes, I kind of do like it, but. I do too. I think it's beautiful, yes. Um. Yeah, y'all just talking to us. Thank so you, Deanna. Something. I love that picture. I want you to do the lady with the hair. <laughs> God, you should see the picture I sent her. It was Jill, awful. you didn't send it. It's in with the paper that you kept. Nope, it came earlier. It's probably in a box you haven't gone through yet. Oh, I, no. I have the box that you sent me back that was mine. I've got it right here. That's I where I pulled this be, out of. Yeah, I'm thinking the picture might even be for that. Now, this picture I got from another individual. Yeah, I, yeah, I didn't do that one. Judy no. says, I think it's beautiful, but put some lace on the other side. Oh, I can do that, Judy, but I was thinking I might. I don't know what it, it ne agreed. It needs it. But I want, I was thinking that I want to be able to it. lift it as a flip since this is pretty and it's got the information on the back. But she's not figured it out how to the yeah. information on the front. I even like her shoes. I don't normally like their shoes. Um, um yeah. I I I mean uh, let's see. I'll play with it. I asked. Let me see. Ooh, three double deck playing cards, one amber canister and one quilt. Okay, where'd I put my, oh my God. butterfly bookmarks and hearts? Oh Judy, I I Ooh. Never want to do that ever. <laughs> so if there's anybody, anytime you guys want to come on and craft and chat, send me a message. We can get on here and craft and chat and see what you guys are doing. I wasn't doing this just so you guys know. Yeah, she told us she wasn't doing it. I'm going, yeah. okay. Paula's not here. No. You know, and she has nothing in front of her to work on. I just, the resin just is so intense to me. It just seems like it would be paying attention and. You just pour it. But don't you have to make sure it's. At you a mix certain... it equal parts and you pour. Oh, well. But you also have to watch. It's very toxic depending upon. Ugh. I'm going to go with the kind you use. I don't know. Yep. Yeah. Sean is, um, he's doing it again, resin, and he's breaking out again. Oh, no. The one he thought he was, he could yeah, use. Be okay. Jeez, he oh, that's sad. I'm like, just take some Benadryl and suck it up. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he'd tell me. He yeah, would tell I mean. us that. I only say that. Well, I don't know. I, yeah. I am trying to knit. I'm trying to Tunisian crochet a shawl that is driving me insane, Janine. Yeah, those are a lot of prod. You guys have got a lot of ideas out there. How many of you actually pulled anything and put it in the box to work on? I do that and then it doesn't get worked on. We're down to that. 25 boxes of stuff. Oh. Deanna, what kind of resin are you using? Maybe Sean needs to use that. Where Maybe you don't have to mix it. Okay. New new thought. I bought two 25-gallon bottles, the two that you mix, when I lived in Pennsylvania. And it's just too cold. Sorry. And it was no way I could do it in the house. It was killing me. Oh, no. I'd say not. Oh, Judy, you're making a digi kit. Yeah, can you believe that? I'm impressed. Very nice. I want to see it when you're done. 
that is something I just don't think I ever want to try, but you know. Sweetheart Sean is here. Would you like to say hello to oh, him? Yeah. <laughs> don't encourage him, sweetheart. We got him calmed oh, yeah. down. We think. Well, that's what he has now, Aaron. Um, UV resin. Um, I can't think of the name, but he's getting our mixed media stuff together. There you go, Jasper. You can always make digis of your collages. Those are some of my favorite digis to purchase. Collages? Yes. Uh-huh. I, I like um, working with them. I love to work with them. Tags and ephemera especially. Maybe this just isn't the right photo. I like the photo. Judy, I'll let you come on and show it off. So I think I have found my next craft and chat um, project. I watched a video. I think her name is Tony the Crafter. I will look to make sure. Um, I've started buying stuff. She made faux metal tags out of foil tape. So we're going to get on and play with that one weekend. Next weekend, we're having couples therapy with Aaron and Chris. We're going to sell with Aaron and Chris next Saturday before they go down and see Brenda. We are I'm just sitting here talking away as you all. I didn't realize you had the screen on me still while I'm just typing away. Oh, that's okay. I sent you both a message in private chat. I am going to say thank you so much for inviting me. I appreciate it. But um, I've got to go now and I will be back in the chat shortly. Thank All you. Right, Ms. Paula, have a wonderful okay. day. You your, too. Enjoy um, your, your dinner has me very focused from last night on today's dinner, but I don't know if I can eat all that yet. Anyway, okay. <laughs> Thank you guys very much. It's nice to chat with you all. I'll be back and just chat by myself and a few. Bye. Bye, Paula. Bye. Bye. Where'd she go? She's not there. Tell her I left. Bye. Will do. Thank you. Bye-bye. Okay, Lindy. Walk me through what you did. What did you do first? You did your flaps, right? Yes. So, Hello, my sweetheart. How we doing? Oh, look, Mr. Rude. <laughs> oh, okay. Put it under. This is what I'm using. Let's resin. Don't drip that on my stuff. Oh, you'll be in trouble. You have an A and a B. How's everybody doing today? I am listening. I'm in the other room doing some stuff, but I am listening to everything y'all are saying. Y'all been oh. here already. Hmm. And we thought he couldn't hear us talking about him. 
I know. And Paula's always picking on me. Yeah, she tries to keep you in line. <laughs> it's a full-time job. Oh, my God. She doesn't have enough hours in the day. She doesn't. Oh, and I just messed that up. Not paying attention. Okay. You put your... You sealed your envelope, flappies. Did you score it? I did not. I just took the um, little flap mm -hmm. and I glued it down. Sometimes you can just, you don't have to glue it. I just like to make sure because it's... I like to finalize it. it. Yep. I like to sign them. Yeah. And then I cut it down. It's a 9 by 12, so I cut it to 10 by 11. Okay. That's my fabric. This is that's my cool. inside that's already done. Pretty. And then I'm going to sew them together. When, But I thought I'd get them all going together. So. Well, I went and found an envelope for whatever that's worth. <laughs> Just one. I used them all. I was greedy and used them all. And then I used Fabri Tac. And just I love the yellow them. gingham too. That's Let's pretty yellow open gingham. Open it first. Yes, I love it. But I wish I would have put something white underneath there. I think it washes it out a little bit. Mm, not bad though. Not too bad. No, it still looks pretty nice. Or used a white envelope. Oh. I I that's all I had was a cream colored one. Off white, just barely. Yes. I found this material. So. Let me get back on both of us so you can see. Okay. Show light, them again. Light pink. Yes. With darker pink roses and my sage green leaves. <laughs> That's beautiful. I love this material. Somehow I was blessed with about two yards of it and I'm dying to figure out what I'm going to do with it. So I thought this would be a good idea. See, I couldn't pre-plan, so I've, I've drawn a blank. This is 12 by nine okay i'm good with this because i'm going to score um fine so five and a half an inch i need more than an inch spine probably yeah i think so an inch and a half all right let's calculate ladies <laughs> where's the paper at that is sad Pencil, paper. I'm a very visual person. Oh, I'm hooked on this candy that Candy made. Lindy, I love it. Yes, the hard rock candy. Oh my God, yes, I'm, I'm eating it like, like I've never had anything sweet in my life. I didn't make any for about three years now. I love the cinnamon. I'm still trying to decide if I like the cinnamon candy or the cinnamon smell after I make it. <laughs> Uh-oh, what have I done? Uh-oh, Alicia has a new outlook. Pretty vintage jewelry should not be disassembled for crafting to used or cherished as it. I know. Now, there is such a thing as I wouldn't wear it. It's kind of gaudy, but if you take it apart, Alicia... Alicia, you can remake it into something that you would use. So if it's not to your taste, those are the ones you take apart. I've got her another pile started, but there's not much in it yet because I haven't bought any lately. Who is Alicia? That's Sweetheart's daughter. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, she's a doll baby. We're buddies now. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, did you get the other box with the album that we thought was lost, sweetheart?
I forgot my scoreboard, ladies. You see, I don't craft at this table. This is my cell table and piddle table. So nothing is in here that I need to craft with. Oh. <laughs> good, good. I wanted to make sure. I've still got the paperwork. And they, they've messed with me. I'm about said a bad word. They're messing with me on it. So I had to. I'm glad we didn't do any refunds or anything on that. What happened, sweetheart, was I had yours all in one box, but it was cheaper to ship it in two boxes shipping-wise for you. So I broke it back into two boxes, but I remembered I had it in one, and that's why when you called and I saw it, I thought, oh, my God, I forgot I'd put it in two boxes to save you shipping. Duh. What a moment. What yeah. a moment. <laughs> you can see the box you got. They had to cover it with a piece of paper. The hole was so big. Wow. And I had put this album she had bought, beautiful leather cover, in a sack. And I knew what was in there with it. Well, when I switched to two boxes, I had to redo that. So that's why I thought, yeah, somebody's helped themselves and they picked through and took what they wanted and stuff up stuff back. Erin, I cannot wait to see these paper clips. I started to say, are we doing flowers? Oh no. If you want to come on and show them off, Jill and I will let you join us. We would love to see what you're doing. Yes. Because we're nosy little stink pots. Oh, so I was telling them um, when Paula was leaving that we are going to craft and chat and make these faux um, metal tags. Yeah, she said um, she uses tape and I pulled it out of my drawer and I said, I know, I'd love to revisit that. Oh. Yes. So if anybody wants to join and craft along, you can come on live with us or... You can craft at home. I know some of you do not want to come on here. That's okay. But I have a list of supplies that you will need. So, Jill, here's my cover. So, oh, I like when it. I go to the sewing machine, I will just glue these two together. Sew them babies up and be beautiful. Yep. And then that will add a lot of dimension to that yellow gingham, too. Yes, and it makes it more sturdy when you use two instead of just one. Oh, yeah. Oh, I think so, too. I don't like to put even the back of a paper pad in there, but I have tried that before, and if you, I cheated on it, too, because I wanted it to be more perfect. I slit the bottom of the envelope, inserted and glued the back of a paper pad to it, and basically did my spine too and then re-glued the bottom and did what you're doing now which gave it a little bit more body but i didn't like it as well as what you're doing that was much better i liked the feel of it better all right jasper wants to join us do you mean next saturday or now or what do you mean um next saturday is a cell saturday so oh, yeah, i don't forgot be a few weeks unless we jump on on a Saturday evening or a Sunday. Oh, guys, I've got to tell you, you know, Rosita had a baby goat neighbor, had a baby yes. goat horn. Oh, my son brought me a baby goat that fit in the palm of my hand. <gasps> and I warmed her up, put her put her in my shirt front on a heating pad on top of that and she is now walking around with her two brothers mommy had three uh, 
I've got to I got to get pictures to show you at the next sale. I will cuz you are going to squeal just like I did. Here he come with that baby goat and I'm going He said, "Mom, you got to do something. She's cold as cold as I'll get out." And I'm going, "Oh, give her here. I know how to fix that part now. Get me some formula." She's so little we had to use a, a syringe to feed her. We didn't have a nipple Aww. small enough. I did at home, but I was 30 minutes away, so So I'm going over tomorrow to take pictures. All right. I can't wait to see. Oh my God. You'll have when you come, you make time and I'll take you over. You can play with her. He's okay. got several. That, um, he's, got a baby, he's got a baby calf that uh, follows him like a puppy. It's uh, he's not even two yet. Oh that I fell in love immediately. And Dave said, You're not bringing it home, so you might as well see if they've got a room here where you can stay. If you're if you think you're gonna have the goat, you're keeping it here and you'll stay here. I'm going, you'll miss me because I cook. That's right. Hi. And you yep. can't tell me what to do, Dave. <laughs> well, I came into this and I was I had so many more critters than I even do now. And I promised him I would try not to add more. It didn't work. But I couldn't I know. Him. So I try to, to remember he lives here too, but it is really hard. <laughs> it is. And sometimes you just want to go, hey, if you would like a place to stay, how about you not tell me what to do? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I wouldn't know what to do without him, but I know he gets frustrated. He's very patient with the critters because I told him, I said, I'm not happy without him. But she is a doll baby. I don't know what they named her because I'm sure they've come up with something I won't like, but it doesn't matter because she's so stinking cute. Oh, my God. <laughs> Okay, Lindy, when you use the material, did you put the heat and bond and another fabric under it? Or did you just glue it straight on? Or are you just going to glue around the edges and then sew it? What, how much glue did you use? I just glued the center and then I glued the flaps down. Okay. Just so you could catch it with your machine? Yep. Okay. And then... I glue my corners down. Oh yeah. And then I fold them in. Some people will cut across. So it's kind of whatever you want to do. I like to miter those corners. It's a pain in the butt, but I'm so happy when I'm done. That me too. And then if I don't like it, then I throw on the corners, you know. Exactly. Yeah, I can put on the pretties. Throw on those. Oh, Aaron, off. COVID kicked your tush so you don't do the group sales anymore. Darn it. Those leather samples are nice. Who'd I get leather from the other day? And I was skeptical. I think it was Pearl. And I'm skeptical of the pleather. Oh, my God. I love it. Oh, it's safe as my grandson's bottom. <laughs> Sample books are always great. Yeah. Okay. We have a spine. We're not progressing very fast here. I don't know what I'm going to fold this in half. Because somebody didn't pre-plan this one. Oh, that might be the best one we make yet. I don't. I gather like what supplies when I know I'm going to craft and chat and tell you guys what I'm going to work on. But other than that, I don't plan. No, I don't either because I, uh -uh. I take all my time. But I didn't want to be a slow poke today i wanted to have an idea and i can't talk intelligently let's put it that way you really need my decoder ring yeah if i have to chat and make a decision well you watched me last night how huh? and you know i don't <laughs> like it if i say i don't know what do you think oh, you so mad at me. And i'm going i can't help it Okay. I'm going to have to use the heat and bond. I won't be able to stand myself. It's a personality dysfunction. All right. Yes, Jasper, that's a good um, idea. 
that's what she's doing. Brenda suggested to do a um, video sell. Oh, yes. I have pretty good luck with my video sales. Oh, and then with that. my extra pieces off of my um, my fat quarters, uh -huh. I take and I cut them down into five inch squares for fab fabric flips. And then I cut the rest of them down to make ruffles. I need, I've got a box of material. It's beautiful. All you need to do is put it on the sewing machine to make ruffles. And I mean, I have a box full of it rolled up. Beautiful material. And do you think I have not taken the time to do that? Bad baby. Well, I'm hoping that since I'm cutting that down too at the same time that mm -hmm. I can put it together and get those done. <laughs> That sounds like a really good plan. That's okay. the plan. Comment. However, we all mm -hmm. know plans don't always work. Not usually at my house. I think it's going to be gorgeous. And then when I do it, I'm thinking it's not gorgeous anymore. Oh, Janine, that's not good. Candy's dealing with um, loss of taste buds and that not would be horrible. smell and... I would be very upset about that. Yeah, she's not happy about that, but what can you do? Not much. Well, we're going to have to have some sage green. Anybody got me a solid sage green about a half a yard of it? I have some sage green. Well, no, it's not really a sage. Yeah, if it's mint, I don't like it, but if it's sage or olive, not olive, probably wouldn't go with this. Well, that's a pink background, so that is not going to work. And I'm not going to see my background. It will, too. Does anybody talk to themselves like this when they're doing stuff? I hope. Thank God, you, Janine. Um, were you at the last sale? I think I sold out of this, but... I can look. This is one of my favorites. It is. I don't know what kind of material it is. Uh, it's definitely not cotton. It's like a satin fill on the back. Those are hard to handle, but they're gorgeous. But, oh my gosh, I love it. So I'm like, it's going to be a, a journal cover. So that's 12, so I need 13 by 10. Oh, who would cut a tiny piece like that out? Someone should shoot me. Because I'm betting I did it. Betcha. <laughs> that little bitty corner there, and I had to go and screw the material up. Go away. I am by far not good at this. <sighs> oh, but I don't know how you from it. Don't know how you get good at it if you don't try. Oh, Lindy, tell her about the. Yeah, she wants to know what you're making next. So next is going to be faux metal tags. Yes, so I was flipping through one night and this YouTube video came up. Her name is Tina. I will find her video and link it below. I made a um, supply list of things that you would have to have if you want to screenshot. Why won't this tear straight? Oh, and then there are some on the back. Um, so she takes cardstock 
and she cuts it down. I probably will not cut mine down. I want, I want as much as I can get because Sean and I loved them. Um, and then she took foil tape and covered her card stock. Some of them she put die cut letters mm -hmm. under it. And then she used distressed paint and alcohol inks and distressed stains. And she colored it and made it look like old industrial. When she's done, she stamps on it and then she cuts them down into tags and labels and that kind of thing. But you can't see the foil tape until the very end. And then you, you take a wet wipe, I think, and go around the edges and it exposes the tape and shows silver. It is so cool, Wendy. I will send the link or I'll try to link it below um, our live craft and chat so everybody can go and watch. Maybe um, I've reached out to Tina to see if she would like to come and join us that day. Um, it's her idea. Not my idea, but I'm going to play with it. She used silver foil duct tape like your... You repair, repair tape. Yeah, like you'd repair it if you had a small hole or something. Yes. That's what I used, and it it's great. So I also found that they have copper and they have black foil, so I will be using all three. I want some copper. I did not know. When I was doing this 100 years ago, it, it wasn't the same technique. It was the same technique, but she took it further than the girl I watched did. So this will be really good. But they didn't have copper back then, or if they did, it wasn't easily accessible. Yes, I found it on great. Amazon. So um, I'll go pick me some up. I will send everyone the link if you are interested. Um, so I started buying all of my stuff because I have to do it. It's so cool. You'll love it. And you, I tell you what, now back then we weren't doing collage sheets much. It would be cool to just do collage sheet and then you could cut into tag. Oh, yeah. It it would limit you, of course, if you wanted to do specific stamps or something, but you can kind of get an idea. Yes. Of where what's going to be. <laughs> that would make a cool collage sheet that you could just pick up and make cards out of. That would be great. Dang it, that was not what as you should have. This is cotton material, it should have ripped. Wendy, are you going to craft and law with that? Um, with that project, or do you want to go live and do it with us? Okay, you better rip. I'm trying to talk Sean into sitting in too. He can sit here and I can sit back there and read the thing and you can watch him craft. Is he being non-compliant? Is that what you're telling us? <laughs> oh, he says he, there's no room for me to craft and chat too. And I'm like, I can sit at that small table behind us and just chat in the crowd you know somebody needs to watch because if we get to doing this we don't always get to watch chat as close yes but Makes i'm sense. hoping that tina will join us that would be great uh, it's going to be a couple of weeks So guys, tell us what you're going to have at your live sale, Aaron, and Wendy, and Sean. What are you guys selling? Books. I am finishing up one of my girl file folders. Um, yes, I forgot about that. Yes. So I'm going to be finishing that up. Let's see. What else have I worked on? Um. Oh, Sean has some pink and green 
writing boards. Someone requested those, so he's been working on those. Oh, um, no. <laughs> and it's going to match my file folders. Um, that would be perfect. Let's see. What else? Of course, he's working on some tags, but they're men. He's trying to figure out what base he wants on those. Okay, Wendy, I'll talk to you later and send you her video. And do you have Tim Holtz distress? Um, hello, Michelle. And then I, um, okay, we got to iron this. I can't stand it. I have three pairs of fabric scissors, Guggenheim. Do you think I have a single pair of them with me? Oh. They are the best. And I'm messing around with these. <laughs> Good dummy. Yes, we got to get that into soon. When are you ready, Wendy? Oh, the stamp and die cut thing I said? Yes. Yes, I'm excited about that one, too. Me, too, because I'm not embossed yet. So. I have a wonderful industrial embossing machine in here that my niece gifted me, surprised me with, and I've used it very little. And I want to start using it more. It's sheer laziness is all it is. There's that one. And I'm used to like Anna Griffith's little embossing machine. Pretty cute. Very small. Not hard to operate. This one's a little more involved. After the 13th of April. Gee, I don't know if I can stand okay. it that long. I'll try. Well, let's see. I got a calendar here. As busy as you are, you'd have to. Hi, Michelle Noel. It's Jill from Hallucinations by Jill C. I fell with Paula and Mel. Melody. Hi, Toby. Wendy, do you want to stamp and emboss on the 20th, April 20th? Good to see you, Michelle. It's been a while. We used to hit sales together and we have like tastes. <laughs> <laughs> Again, another person to fight with over stuff. And it's fun to, to banter back and forth. Hi, Toby. Welcome. All right, Wendy. I got you on the 20th. Stamp and emboss. If anyone else would like to craft and chat and do something, you just reach out to me and we will definitely get it worked out. On the 27th, um, we will do the faux metal tags with by Tony. Cool. So I'll get a supply list for the metal tags, labels. And hopefully Tony can join us. Uh, 
I don't know if I can wait that long. I'm, I'm probably I'm it. It. Yeah, I'm dying here. <laughs> Those were the good days, Michelle. <laughs> Still making some good ones, but I enjoyed those immensely. Lisa, it used to be Michelle two L's and Michelle one L. <laughs> so, um, let's see. I know, Aaron. It's fun still, though. I think a lot of this, if you don't have it, you could get from Wendy or Michelle. Oh, good. I need um, sources. I'm going to have to be like some of these girls and go on a spending freeze. So you need scorched timber paint you need speckled egg paint ground espresso salvaged patina and vintage photo that's what she uses in her video and then of course i'm going to play and take the speckled egg out and put in green at some point so i am um, going to use some green paint yeah, that was so sad there. And then she used gold wax at the very end. Um, you need a texture hammer and some eyelets and brads. Stays on ink and black or archival, whichever you want to use. Corner punches, of course. You need number stamps or letters, whatever industrial type thing you want. Alcohol ink and caramel. Of course, your foil tapes, cardstock, alcohol ink. Um, she used the caramel. I also wanted to try ginger, patina, and mushroom. Mushroom is really pretty. It takes on a pink color, she said. So I was like, ooh, that'd be great when I do a shabby yes. chic metal it tag. Does. Yep. With the I'd black probably tape. Not going to do the industrial, so I'm going to have to go watch her and adjust my supply list accordingly. Yes. Um, hang on, Wendy. I, um, Jill's got some right there, and then I bought no, some off grab. of Amazon. Let me grab mine. She was talking about it. I said, ooh, 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 I got some. I've yeah, got and it. then um, sandpaper or the, the Tim Holtz sand disc, and then yeah. distress collage medium and then she used distress stain with vintage photo which i cannot find so michelle i'll be hitting you up how to your stash michelle find it for us we'll be calling you i think even you can get different widths in this now yes so i so got the two inch yeah and I'm not sure what this is. I don't think it's but an inch and a half. No, this is almost two inches. It likes it a quarter, an eighth of an inch being a two-inch roll. And you see how much I used of it. At the time, the journal sizes that I was making, this was perfect tags. Yeah. And I got this at like uh, Menards. No, they didn't have Menards. I don't think Menards was a thing around here. I think probably Lowe's. Home Depot, something like that's where I got mine at. Because I go, I did go to both of those places. But, and she took this to an all new level. Mine weren't that involved. So I'm anxious to try adding, you know, more to it. So this is a 3.9 mil and it's two inch. Yep. 65 feet. So I got two rolls of silver. I think I have two rows of copper and black coming. And then I got brads. Because you're going to smash them. Oh, let's take the tape off, Lindy. Woo. So I got these um, brads. They got this large head on them. 
So, so they, can they can see them better. So when you put them on, you are going to end up smashing them with your texture hammer. Ooh. Come on. Ooh, ooh. It does not want to focus. It's just fighting with that shiny, isn't it? It is. Let's see. Oh, that's better. There you go. Yep. I've got a bunch of those in my stash in there. I just keep saving them. Now I know why I saved them. Yes. So. For a reason. It is going to be fun. Tony, um, I've reached out to her. So hopefully she will come on and do the craft and chat with us. And she can explain the process better than me because I've only watched the video. But my stuff is coming. Yeah, I'm going to get in, look into the black and the copper because I would be very interested in them. Yes, I seen them and I'm like, yep, yeah, please, I will take those too. But of course, the silver comes quick. Oh, yeah. Well, that's what most people want. They don't think about us using it. Yes. Oh. So when I find craft and chat pro um, projects that I can have supply lists, I might get with Wendy and Michelle and see if they can put kits together. Yeah, if it's not you can purchase from them. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be great. Because it's discouraging if you don't have time to sit and look for it all. Yes. I and know then you find it at certain places and they're sold out and you're like, oh. Now, what don't I have still? What don't I have ordered? Oh, my God. Yes. I, I ordered stuff not too long ago, and I got one out of five. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's not good. No. I've got so many of your kids right now, Wendy. I'm never going to get it all done. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to get the papers I just got from you. Those, I don't need them. I'm not going to be able to do anything with them, but they are gorgeous. Some of those papers I got. I'm so excited. All right. Somebody go get my iron. Let's just do this. <laughs> Boy, I changed my mind. I know you love building kits, Wendy. I know it. I want you to know, Wendy, that I have a one of those fold-down collapsible material tote thingies. Yeah, that was a technical term. Full of, of uh, I have some plastic things that are huge that I can put full kits in. Yeah. And if I find things for each paper and kit that I bought from you, I cram it in there. <laughs> so you are enabling me to be a hoarder. More so than I already am. You have your own box. <laughs> All righty. Let's see if I can make a mess of this. <clears throat> I got off track one day with this and heat and bonded it to my mm -hmm. iron board cover. <laughs> yes, Toby, I agree. Cause I was like searching for all of this stuff and I was like, that would be great, Michelle. You and Wendy get together and figure out or whatever. That's a lot of supplies. See, mine weren't that involved, so I'm really excited about her version. Yeah. So excited.
Well, if Pearl was here, she'd be making fun of me. Don't tell Rosie that I did this on a live. <laughs> what? Oh, ironing. I'm, I'm ironing. <laughs> oh, God, she'll get me. <coughs> You're making this look bad, is what she tells me. Like, no, I'm not. You look bad you're doing that without my help. I didn't do a thing wrong. Yes. It's that, a show yes. with two L's. Yes. <laughs> and and Danielle. Um, Man, I thought I'd just ironed that to the right side instead of the wrong side. Dear God. I cannot think of the name of Michelle's channel. I've got a lot of supplies, Michelle, but some of those I don't even have. She took this a lot. Crafting creations. The creative one. studio. Yes, you did miss one. I don't know if she's still got one of those left or not, Paula. I'd have to, I can't even remember the name of it now, but it's gorgeous. Yes, thank you, Wendy. I thought. Okay. Yay. Lag was horrible at that sale. It seemed to get worse as the sale went on, too. All righty. Now, if that'll cool down, we're in good shape. Maybe. Everybody's quiet. Everybody stay up last night and sleepy. I know we had a couple of stayed up. I did not. I have dinner with my son. His birthday was Wednesday. So we said happy birthday. So we are taking him and his fiance to dinner tonight. I want to go because you're going to Hacienda. We are. Oh, man, I love that place. Love it. Come on down. Uh, I stayed up all night. Got about three hours sleep. <laughs> My youngest is coming for dinner. I promised hot rolls from scratch. Meatloaf, mashed potatoes, gravy, green beans, garden cord, and a salad with hot rolls. Yum. Uh, yep. So I got to do a little prep work if they're coming. Got to do some prep. All righty, that will work. And I didn't have. I love that cutter. Yeah, I wonder what we're going to put on the inside. We need a pretty rose color, don't we? Oh, be perfect. 
I know, but I've got big boys that I fed like that all their lives. So they like that food. Yes, Paula, we were trying, I was trying to think of Michelle Hartley. I couldn't even think of her last name. I was like, you know, the two L's. <laughs> that one. But Wendy put her channel, your creative studio in. Who do you want to show the outside? Lindy, she's really got a pretty one going. Soft pink background, Paul, dark pink roses and sage green foliage. There you go. You like it? It's pretty. I want to find the sage green for the inside, but I don't know that I can. So we shall see. Okay, thank you. I didn't need to leave enough edges to mount to anything, so I'm going to have to sew them for sure. Because I'm a sloppy cutter. Hold it up, please. That kind of matches this, some of it that I'm going to do here on my other journals. I'll have to show you. And where are your glasses, Paula? Thank you, Toby. This material just looks so dainty and shabby chic and vintage. It's just got it all. It's just a pretty See, material. You know, look, it goes with this one. Ooh. And then I have this green polka dot that goes with it. Ooh, I love polka dots. They'd either clash or they'd be perfect, wouldn't they? Yes. But on the island, your glasses are on the island in the house and you're outside. Yep. And then here's my other one. Oh, I love that. That is gorgeous. That is so me. Thanks, Michelle. Catch you Michelle. soon. Yes, Michelle. Have a wonderful day. Thank you for coming in. Got to go back to work. We're sorry. <laughs> I had to work yesterday. I know. Oh, it sucks, doesn't it? It does. Uh, I'm, like, I'm ready to retire. I love it. I'm not going to lie to you a single bit. I love it. I've not been bored yet. They gave me two weeks to be bored. And I said, you've lost your mind. I will not be bored that's what, I work with a lady, she's 72, and she's not ready to retire yet. And I look at her every day, and I'm like, can I retire for you? <laughs> Let me go in your place. <laughs> you just want to stay here as long as you want. I just want to go. <laughs> I don't want to stay with you guys anymore. No, don't make me. I had all that material, and I cut that too. I'm not doing it. I cut it too little. No, I didn't. No, da, 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 da. I'm not going to like that. Oh, well. Maybe. See, Ooh, I'm ready to retire. I still have some years to go, but I am ready. April 1st, Dave will have been retired, I believe, nine years. So, I love it, Judy. I do. Uh, yes, Deanna, it's great. He and I retired a year and a half after he did. He said I wasn't supposed to do that because that took his play money away. <laughs> I said, wham. Wow. Sorry for you. <laughs> yep, he said I took his play money away. We did too, Judy. He had some uh, neuropathy 
going on in his feet. Couldn't wear the steel-toed boots. Plus, we'd already planned on it before that even cropped up, and then that just made the final decision for us. So it worked out. We both are, were loving it. We're not fabulously rich, but we don't have to be. We are very comfortable. Well, when I get done with this, I should have just got the little envelope out and played with it. I have one of them, too. Judy, I'm trying to make it to 62. That means I have to work 10 more years. Oh, However, I'm really trying to see if I can early out at 57 and a half. Yep. It's pushing it. Our house isn't paid off yet, but we'll see. Judy, we checked and we could make just as much uh, retiring at 62 as we could if we waited. Toby, it's red and blue. It's um, Kathy Holden fabric. All right, let's take a peek here. <coughs> oh, excuse me, girls. I want my iron back. Now, who put my iron up? Let's not be an overachiever here. Fabulous. Erin, are you selling those next weekend? Oh, heck, where did I put oh. my blue lid? Toby, I use a um, 9 by 12 envelope for my backing. And then I sew a front and a back together to make journal covers. So what the orange is the envelope. Oh, man. Oh, you guys are going to want to come and check these out next weekend. Those will be here next weekend. Cool. Saturday at 12? Yes. I haven't even looked. I, I mean, I saw it, but I didn't go to it and do any double checking. So. so I'm wanting to sit down and do some snippets. So I guess I'll take it downstairs, my little basket, and work on them down there. Because when I'm upstairs, I think, oh, you need to do stuff you can't do downstairs. <laughs> like, oh, dear. Lindy, Aaron says you can show us if you want. Okay. That's what we were waiting for, Aaron. Thank you. God, I love that material. Ooh. I'm trying to get, let me turn this off. Come on. I have to turn my overhead on off and turn a lamp on to get my colors good. Okay, hang on. Let's see. Because my overhead's doing the same thing today. Because we got oh. an overcast outside. It's beautiful here. I should have my Heidi out there, but I wanted to do this badly. It just does not want to pick up on that pink. You have one other than on the, you don't have a live one with you. I was hoping she sent you a live one. Isn't that a weird way to look at it? Oh, here we go. Well, there you go. Well, kind of. It's hard to see, but the colors did pop and it did clear up. Come on, Paul. Oh, right there. Can you guys see it there? Not very well, no. I couldn't tell you what it was if I had to. But you're talking to the blind girl on the little screen. Toby, I live in Enfield, Illinois. I am way down in Southern Illinois. I like the colors. Yes. Yeah. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yep, I'm, I'm a Southern Illinois chick. Good deal. <sighs> Wait till you guys see the dresses, though. Ooh. That's all I'm going to say. Wait for the dresses. I guess we'll have to. 
she won't retire. <laughs> Stay home. <laughs> you recognize my accents, Toby? Yeah, Chicago. You're a little ways from me. Deanna sent you a picture, Wendy. Oh. Maybe it'll come up different. Oh, is this your resin? Come on, baby. Oh, those are gorgeous. I Deanna does amazing work. I know it. I, well, they're on my nose, Paula. My glasses are, but you know, that doesn't always help. Yeah. Those are very dimensional looking. They are beautiful. I love them. I know you got a big glare right there in the center, but I'm trying to let you see. Oh, my God. And those, you're selling those, Deanna? I love this white one. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I love that blue one on the right. Ugh. She is amazing. I just don't know if I'd like the resin. I think I'll leave that to you and Sean. Sean, I need butterflies, too. He's, he's close to me, guys. He's like <laughs> an hour, hour and 15 minutes or so. You're busy. Yes, yeah. Deanna, Sean wants to know what mold you used for those. Giving away trade secrets, Sean. <laughs> I love that we all play so well together like that, though. Anybody got any 14, 16 by 12 embossing folders for sale with like a vining or florally background? What size? I need a 14 plus long by 12 or bigger. But and what need... size machine does that go through? I have a, my niece gifted me that big embossing machine that is a, an industrial one. Okay. I'm it's like, um, I can go up to 16 wide, I think, or 20. I can't remember because I can't find any molds or any embossing folders that are pretty like I want. The ones that are bigger are kind of ugly. Interesting. So I'm going to get on Timu and I'm going to get on I, Amazon hasn't got anything and I'm going to just pop it in there for anybody. I've been on eBay. I've been everywhere. And it's not working for me very well. Yeah, we're going to have to get up and get the iron. Just do it, Jill. Quit procrastinating. But I'm real picky about the one I want because I'm going to have to pay for it. I can Paula, that white one was amazing. That no was molds. Beautiful. You did those freehand. Now I am amazed. Wow, Deanna. I feel like I'm in the dark without that overhead light on. <laughs> <laughs> Playing in the dark. No mold. Ooh. They are beautiful. She's going to send you a picture of what she uses, Wendy. I did not eat breakfast, and that was a mistake. I'm on antibiotics. It's making me nauseous, so breakfast isn't a good idea.
I think I'm going to try Mel Foulash, Paula. For supper or? I'm not sure. He'll be starving for lunch, but I don't know that he'll make let me make it. <laughs> I don't know if he'll wait that long. The kids, I boiled two dozen eggs for two kids. So we're having egg salad. Ooh, I like it. Egg salad, the odor I get. Mm. He'll only eat pickle relish, mayonnaise, and boiled eggs. That's all he'll put. I can't put a whole bunch of stuff in it, but I can be happy with that. I would like celery and uh, dried cranberries. <laughs> and your egg salad? Uh huh. Oh. I didn't think I would either, but oh my God, I tried it. It's good in chicken salad, but I, I didn't. Know. I wasn't okay. sure I'd like it, so I put it in just mine. Uh huh. Okay. Would have never thought that. Don't put it in. The whole thing until you try it because you might not like it yeah because like chicken salad i like cranberries in there or grapes i like grapes and celery and walnuts and cranberries you can put it all in i'm a happy camper i'm kind of weird like that so but he's we're... plain jane <coughs> excuse me So besides those two, what else do you have planned for craft and chats? Um, those are the only two that I think I have planned. So if anybody else can think of anything, um, let's see. April the 14th, I will be posting a video. I am doing my first hop with um angela over she's the, the traveling crafter um i was invited to do a hop so i'm doing a hop with scraps and it's gonna post on april the 14th so we need to watch for that yes and um i will post her link in today's description because um, she's going to post April 1st, her video, um, getting it all in order with the, what do you call it? The schedule. Yep. Just getting it. Um, Camila, Camila Crafts, um, Julie with Camila Crafts is um, participating. And I love Angela. her. I do too. Did you see her do the heat and bond on cardstock with napkins? I did not. Oh, your stove is going to 22 different people? <laughs> no. <laughs> well, now we know where to get rid of that stuff at, Paula. <laughs> yeah. It's a brand new stove. There's nothing wrong with it. So I'm not really shocked, I guess. I just threw that in the floor. What was I thinking? All right, Deanna, I can do that. Um, if maybe tomorrow before I can call, because after craft and chat, I have to shower and take yeah. the son to dinner. Taco salads. He picked. You've got her on a taco salad now. <laughs> yes. No, her son's not going to give up cooking. He's got major. It's amazing. Why can't I miter a corner today? Lord help me. Glue your corner down first. I was going to, but I can't seem to get the miter corner thing down, Pat. Where's my glue? Look, this is what I do. I glue my corner down and then it miters automatic. That's what I used to do. I'm brain dead today. Yes, and it's a perfect miter, too. Duh, Jill. See, you can't time me. I'd panic for sure. <laughs> time me. Huh? 
It could be an ugly thing. That's why I couldn't stay in the shorthand class because she'd say we're having time tests every day and I was a nervous wreck. How many grills and stuff does he have, Paula? Toby asked her, did her does her son stopping cooking? I'm going, I don't think so. He loves to, he's about like my oldest. Sean used to love to cook and now he doesn't. Bummer. I know. He's got two smokers and a grill and yeah. a griddle and a deep fryer. Four. He's got four, Paula said. I think Jeremy's got two smoker cooker combinations, three grills, and a huge two deep fryers. But he does fish and hush puppies and fries and mushrooms and all that good stuff. Yep. Which we all love to eat, so that works great. Oh, no. <coughs> Come on, nose. Let's cooperate. I don't think my corners are going to be pretty. We better dig out those pretty metal corners. Yeah, but he loves to cook. Now, Dave used to like to cook more. He's got a huge smoker that they made that he pulls behind his truck. And we can take, and my God, he makes the best ham and beans. And uh, what is the roast that he makes? God, I can't think. Um, well, I can see it on the food park sign at the grocery store. Is it a... Uh, Boston butt or a Boston. truck roast? Boston butt. That's the one I want. And mini barbecue. Oh my God. And I make, has anybody tried putting an apple pie in a cast iron skillet with a lid on it? And I bake apple pies and cherry pies on his smoker and they are delicious. Oh, I've not done that. They're very good. I thought, what the heck? And I love cabbage core out the center. And put a stick of butter and your seasonings in it. Hmm. Oh, yeah. That's good too, Lindy. If, and even if you don't like cabbage, I've had people that don't eat it. So. Oh, I like cabbage. Me too. The people around me don't like cabbage um, after I've ate it. No, <laughs> they're not happy with me either. So, Yeah, I knew he bought a trailer. He does go to competitions <laughs> still. I wasn't sure. I know it's a matter of pride to be able to use those smokers. Great. Oh, come on. Let's play nice for Mama, please. Okay, Lindy. Too much bulk here on this material. But I've got two materials and a heat and bond. <laughs> Leah says she loves cabbage and now she has to have some. No, aren't it awful? Now I'm going to have to go down and add the stuff to my... I swore I was eating no more egg salad. <laughs> no more. <laughs> I've still got 10 or 12 eggs that are colored and beautiful that I've got a devil for tomorrow on top of all the other stuff. So for yeah. everybody that knows me, I've started um, this Manjaro injection for diabetes. And it's helped me lose weight, but it gives me weird food cravings. Oh, no. So I went through corn on the cob for about a year, I think. Don't you think? I was eating corn on the cob, like morning, lunch, dinner. And then after that craving went away, it was cotton candy. Oh, God, she's addicted. So I'm trying to not eat cotton candy because I'm diabetic. What? Why am I craving cotton candy? I hated it when I was a kid. Yeah, I didn't ever like it either. No. My mother is like in awe. She was like, how are you eating cotton candy at the age of 52? I'm like, I don't know, but I can't get enough. So I'm trying to wean myself off of it. Now I'm craving taco salads all the time. We, we ate taco salads four times this week. That's why, that's why Paula wants when she told her about it. <laughs> so Tristan picked Mexican and I'm having a taco salad for dinner. 
I think that's perfectly reasonable. It's a healthier trade, right? I'm pretty sure it would be counted. But then there are those people that count chocolate as a fruit or vegetable, which is it fruit or vegetable because it's a bean. <laughs> yeah, that's my mom. She's, she's a chocolate alcoholic. I can count that. Leave me alone. Yep. Yeah, I um, I'm now writing. Well, taco salads. <laughs> I could eat Chinese one day, Subway one way, one day, and then throw in uh, Mexican two or three, and I'm good. Yeah, and I'm good. Sean and Tristan, they can eat pizza any day of the week, and I just don't like pizza. I do. If Dave and I, and we like some of the same, but I love pineapple ham. Oh my God. Yes. Talk about a happy camper. <laughs> Good go. Sweetheart's being awfully quiet. Did she leave us? She, she stayed up all night. Sweetheart, you better not be asleep. Oh, that's right. Alicia, wake her up. <laughs> She better wake her up. We were counting on Erin to keep us awake, but she stayed up all night too. So I think she got a little bit of a nap in, she said. Well, when I got up at 3.30 this morning, I should have just came on live. I started to, and then we could have all chit-chatted and crafted together. I didn't go to bed till I came. I showered at 4.30 and was sitting in the chair sleeping by 5. So you would have missed me. Unless you caught me at three, and then I, I was still up then. I was making ephemera for that journal that I've got all the pages done, and I thought you need to get busy and finish that before I'm trying not to start projects if I don't have some finished. Well, hmm. gonna, we're going to be a little while on that. Is someone having a sale and she had to leave us? Huh. Way to go, sweetheart. Uh-huh. Well, you tell her she was wrong. Okay, I get it now, sweetheart. You said hi, babe, to Sean the legend. And then you just left us hitting high and dry. Ooh. Yeah, she was like, Sean's not crafting. I'm not hanging with these women. No, I see where we rate. <laughs> yeah. Huh. Yeah, I, I never cared for chocolate. And I'm not an ice cream freak, but now I could eat a banana split every day. Well, I'm so fat now, I don't need it. Okay, so are you ready for um, my banana split um, hack? Oh, yes. Buy fresh strawberries and slice them up. And bananas and slice them up. I'm good okay right now. <laughs> Fudge sickles. Slice them up, throw them in there, and some um, some Cool Whip, and that's my banana split. Don't like the Cool Whip much, but the the rest of it, oh, God, yes, I could eat. Strawberries, yeah, I'm a strawberry freak. So it yeah. soon go to a sale. Where did she go? To take a nap, I bet. Hmm. Mm -hmm. That's cheating again. We can't do that. No napping. She'll be like me. She'll be up all day and won't be able to sleep tonight because she's too tired. Tell her she's really on my brat list now. <laughs> With the brat radar didn't go off either. You better check on that. Right? The brat list did not go up. I'm having fits with this, Wendy. I can't impromptu anymore. I used to could. <laughs> not doing it well today. Did you glue your corners down first? I tried and it didn't work for me because it's too thick. See, I've got two pieces of material and the heat and bond, so it's really bulky. Oh. So we're probably just going to have to cheat and do a tuck. I trimmed and tucked. That may be all I only chance choice I've got here. Which, hey, it's a choice. I'll take it. Yeah, the heat, when I use the heating bond, I... I love um, that stuff. I sew right away. But I'm going to try Camille, Camille's, Julie's, where she did the hack with the heat and bond. 
the really tough one super hold then she put it on a really nice grade of cardstock and then she put her napkin napkin oh. on her they are vibrant toby i bet that paper is going to be amazing you oh, have God, to send me pictures i couldn't stand and use my blackberries for that cobbler's the only way to go or jam <laughs> i think i'm going to make some jam in the next little bit blackberry i can only get red oh i bet it will too i can't wait to see um red raspberry jam at our local walmart and i'm going i don't want red raspberry i want blackberry and I pretty much got the impression they don't care. I don't know if we have blackberry jam here yet. I've decided I know how to make it. I should just shut up and make it. So that will fix that problem for me. But then we have to have homemade bread. Yeah. Do you guys let your avocados get really like almost rotten, throw awayable stage? Is that a word, throw awayable? It is now. Yes. It's our, we know. We yeah. know what I it meant. Knew, I knew you had my decoder ring. <laughs> God. We talk the same language. Yeah, it's, it's scary for you to understand what I'm saying. <laughs> Sorry. Scary for you. I was told that the Blackberry Jam BLTs. Oh, I've never had that. But you know what? He had me put butter and my jam on a biscuit and then put a piece of sausage on there. And I looked at him like, oh my God, you're sick. Oh Lord, it's good. So you just use beets. You don't go with the avocados, Brenda? Oh. I, think, I think Paula told me she used beets too, and it was a pretty color. But I can't remember for sure. Yep, she. Ouch, ouch. Paula said she's used beets. Makes sense. It'd make a pretty pink. Quick in, quick out. And then if you want it darker, leave it in a minute or two. She's hoping for purples, more purples. Could happen, Toby. <laughs> now I need my clamps. Yeah, because blackberries and blueberries do not give you purple, which is kind of crazy. Yeah. You think it'd come in somewhere in that vicinity. Yes. Okay. Um, Go get clamps and I'm good on this one. And I can stop it till I can sew. Wendy is now going to try the Blackberry Jam BLTs. Yeah, I'll have to too, Leah. Thank you for contributing to my weight problem. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime. That's why we're here. All the help I've got. <laughs> Always looking for a new recipe, though, I'll admit. We're here to help. Bet you don't get that any cookbook. <laughs> <laughs> the best ones never get written down. They do not. My grandmother made the best chocolate meringue pies. Um, my dad's mom. And nobody has the recipe. Of course not. That would be right. <laughs> And I'm like, oh, I need some chocolate meringue grandma pie, and I can't find it Mom, anywhere. Mom made the best peanut butter fudge. And her recipe was a little different than all the ones, but do you think she wrote it down anywhere? I thought no. I wrote it written down, but no, that would be right. So, no, we don't have it anywhere. Yeah. Alrighty, I'm gonna have to set the camera up in there. I don't have room on my desk. I wouldn't even have a ten by ten spot. We have to add another table. 
All right, you little boogers. Here we go. I know I'm not on screen. I'm nervous watch, letting you watch me glue. Don't ask. I have no clue. You're nervous. I know. Because I'm sure somebody does this much better than I'm pulling off here. But maybe you're doing it different than somebody else and it would help them. That could work. All right, where'd you put your get in? Bring it in. God, you're such a dingy. Like I said, all my craft stuff's in there, and you don't realize until you're not in there how much of it you reach for automatically. Hmm. Well, after all of this, it's still going to be decently pretty. Even after I botched it two or three dozen times here. Changed my mind midstream. I don't bet you none of the others do that. Oh, purple potatoes or purple carrots. Ah. <laughs> purple potato. Okay, this is from someone who cooks a lot. Never had a purple potato. You have not? No. I've never seen a purple potato. Oh, we buy them in the um, little new, like, potatoes. They're little. Yeah. That's how we eat ours. We get them at Walmart. I'm going to have to look. Our Walmart's so small, though. It's not that, not that accommodating. Now I'm going to have to go look for, and when I tell him I want purple potatoes, he's going to have me committed. <laughs> <laughs> you know he will. Maybe he'll pick somewhere close and you can visit with craft supplies. Yes. I bet they won't let me have scissors, though. <laughs> <laughs> Could be a problem. All right. Clamp your butt and stay put. Please. Oh, thank heaven. I'm going to film my scrap video tomorrow so I don't forget. I'm not a big potato person. If I get to choose between a potato and a fruit or vegetable, like broccoli, or I'm going to pick the vegetables, not the potatoes. I know it's kind of weird, but we go to Denny's and I order the hot yeah, the chicken, Bourbon Street chicken, and it's yeah, got potatoes yeah. and broccoli. And I said, I don't want any potatoes. I just want broccoli. And he said, ma'am, I'm sorry. I didn't understand that. And I'm going, yes, you did. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't stutter. Please don't put potatoes in mine. And he didn't. Oh, no, no more. Isn't that what you ordered when we went? Yeah, I don't yeah, want yeah. potatoes. Oh, mashed potatoes. Now I'm hungry. Now I'm going to have to go cook. Dang it, Paula. <laughs> <laughs> going to have to cook now. I need some more clippies. We're going to have to go get them. Okay. Yes, Jasper, that sounds good. Purple cabbage, I forget. Usually it's blue. But if you add vinegar, it changes. But I forget which color it gives you. Oh, either way, you're going to have pretty. So, yeah. Okay, more of the other clips. I'll have my whole craft room moved back in here before I'm done. If I do, we'll be doing more de staffing, that's for sure. Yes, green onions and oh, what kind of steak? Ribeye? That's my favorite. Yes, yeah. taco salad and cabbage. <laughs> oh my God, there's going to be a problem, I think. You're going to be sick. I could eat a big old head of cabbage with a big old butter, not any of the weird stuff. I want the real thing. 
Ugh. And salt and pepper, bacon. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're going to have to get off early because now I'm going to have to go cook. Oh, it's 2 o'clock, Wendy. you got to go take a shower. Yes. So, I just I noticed. You tell him happy birthday. I will do that. He, um... First year that I did not get to see him on his birthday, I was I was really bummed. But he's grown up. I know. I don't care. Doesn't count. Paula scolds me because I I'm still clinging, and I don't care. <laughs> Sorry, I can't help it. Yeah, I try not to meddle, though. I truly am. I'm doing good with that. But. Okay. This Ooh, is a Asian salad. Yum. Does it have oh, apples in it? Is that Panera that I get an Asian salad? Ugh. I've never had an Asian salad. I bet I'd like it. It depends on where you get them. Well, that's yeah, that's a steadfast rule for sure. But I'm pretty sure it was Panera that I got mine from here in Evansville. I like Panera pretty much everything. And oh, and Janine's have an Oriental salad from last night. Oh, cranberries. Yeah, okay. cranberries. Bernays sauce with a filet. I don't know. I've gotten to where I like a porterhouse steak, too, but they're so big, I can't do it. Hello, Wilson. Hey, Wilson. What are you doing? We've missed you. We, um, of course, we've been raising hell. Ooh, Panera sounds good. Dave just never want to stop there. He's real good to go to Hacienda, though. He offers, I love, there's a soup at, darn it, what's the name? The Italian place. Olive Garden. Thank you. He doesn't like it. He said they're too expensive for what you get. I can, oh my God. I knew what you meant, Aaron. That's so sad, too, that I can read you. Yeah, we're dying stuff, and then we're eating the leftovers, there, Cindy. Oh, Aaron, I could eat eggs and toast every day. My son has chickens. So I don't have any anymore. I'm very sad about that, but my husband refuses. Yep. So I love the soup at Olive Garden, and I can order the soup and the lasagna and a salad, and I'm so miserable. You had fish tacos? Ooh, I don't think that sounds good, Wendy. Are they? They are. They are good. Well, it just sounds disgusting. I like mine when they're fixed with mahi mahi. Ugh. No, I don't like that. So that would be no for me. Oh, man. Now I'm going to have to eat, and I don't know what I can make quick. I could have a taco salad. Yes. That wouldn't take See? long. Enough. Taco salads are where it's at. <coughs> I don't have any sour cream, but I don't care. <laughs> Didn't like them until you tried them. Well, I'm going to have to try one now just to see if I do. It just doesn't sound appetizing. I really want to go and get. They have got pretzels. God, I love the pretzels at Subway. So I asked if they'd sell me a case. <laughs> They're frozen. And she said, I can't. So she said, but they're Aunt Annie's. And, and you guys were telling me they're at Walmart. And I'm going, not at my Walmart. They're not. So I'm just going to have them have to get me some. I'm going to have to go to a bigger Walmart. Yes, Toby. The potato gnocchi. Oh. But I also like their sausage um, soup. Oh, yeah, Cindy. That's anyway. It's got all the vegetables in it, Toby, and I don't know the name of it. Um, uh, the soup that Olive Garden has. The minestr minestrone? Is that no. what? 
I, it's good too, but it's not minestrone because I know I would know it. But <clears throat> um, oh, it's just got everything that I love in it more. Is it sausage oh. and spinach and yes. bacon? Oh yeah, it's got it all. Tomatoes and I don't know what all. Hmm. And I keep thinking I'll remember to look it up, but I haven't. Pasta fagioli. This is a soup. Is it? The, is that the name of the soup? That may be it, because it's weird enough. I wouldn't be able to remember it. I'm not Italian. Wedding soup. Ugh. All I know is I want the recipe, and I bet I can find it. Now, I make the um, no, Italian meat. sausage and spinach soup. I make that at home. Dave won't touch any of that. You know how long? I know I'm not saying that right. <laughs> I'm not Italian. I'm French Indian and <laughs> Scottish. <laughs> so I'm going to have to take lessons on that. That was pretty, Lindy. This is Sean's Halloween. He wants Halloween covers made, so... That's one of his Halloween covers. I saved one piece of Halloween paper. One. And I know exactly what I'm doing with it. He's got some ideas for his. He's going to have a, a really cool circus. It's very dark. <coughs> but it's so cool. It will, won't it, Cindy? I love Halloween. I John is a it. huge Halloween person. But I have all of this fabric I need to put on oh, covers. Oh my gosh. And then here's the second stack. <laughs> Another stack. I was appalled by one, Lindy. Oh, my God. Ooh, I like that blue. What is that? Not striped. It's in the middle. Right here? Nope. Flip it over. It's a light. I don't see it now. Dang it. Where'd it go? Oh, it's behind the yellow. It's a uh, plaid. This one? Yes. It's purple. You're kidding. It looks pretty blue in here. Mm -mm. It's lilac. And then I have my B fabric. Yeah, I've got B fabric too. Ooh. I have a celluloid photo album I'm going to make into a, I'm going to use to put the B album in. It's got a B on the front of it and a celluloid, the old, old, old ones. I love them. Yeah, so I got to get all of this organized and put together. And I think so, Toby. <laughs> Yeah, organization I'm getting better with, but it's still, I'm, I'm a long way. Yep, I me too, I went, but I'm getting there. I went through my filing cabinet and organized my digitals to at least I can find them now to use them. But I'm appalled at how I ported them also. We could have a Halloween challenge, Leah. Oh, there you go. See, here's, Ooh, Sean's got these. a lot of Halloween but I don't this like one is my food. favorite. Oh, I do like that. I like the pop of blues in that. It's got bright it's colors. Exactly. I love it. So he's got a big collection of Halloween. He does. Yep. So now it's my job to put it on the paper so he can make his journals. Paula says, you're supposed to be getting ready for dinner. Your time is getting shorter by the moment. <laughs> All right. I'll finish this one up and then I'll say goodbye. We don't want you to be late. You'll be in trouble. I will be in trouble because. Yes. He'll want to order. He may eat without you, mom. 
he's actually wanting to go to the um, Mexican restaurant because he wants a margarita. You and me both. I do. I drink maybe four a year <laughs> and I'm behind already. So does anyone in your area, do you guys get the soft drink ski? Yes. I know Jill knows it. It's it used to only be sold in this area, but I'm not sure. I think they expanded. Yeah, we can get it over here now. They, um, Thank you, Toby. At Hacienda, they make that into a margarita. And I, I saw uh, that. Have you ever and, tried it? Yes. Oh, man. Yes, it is. Aaron. <laughs> Fascioli, am I close? Fasci Happy Easter. Happy Easter, everyone. I will um probably be on in the morning before we do our Easter thing. I'm gonna start doing a the do. I don't like do, thank God. Happy Easter, Janine. Send Happy Easter, Janine. Shaw. Thank you for coming. Send me a picture of that shawl. I can't wait to see it. Mine doesn't look like a shawl yet. <laughs> and don't forget, if anybody wants to craft a chat, yeah. give okay. me a holler. Thank you, Aaron. I'll practice. We're going to test you next week, Jill. Oh, God. <laughs> Okay, I got to come back and review this every day, multiple times. <laughs> so sad. Thanks, guys. Maybe I'll get it done and can show you the finished product. <laughs> yep. The evil rabbit never leaves Cindy Wilson chocolate. How dare he? Because we know it's not a she if they don't leave women chocolate. No, it can't be. That'd be wrong. It's a he. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. Just like men made bras. We know this. Yeah. Yeah. All right, man. You have a good time with your son. Tell him we said happy birthday. And I'll catch you guys the next Craft and Chatter sale. I'll be seeing you. Wilson, right. you got to come off of this. I can't spend anything. Or you're going to have to get stronger on not bidding on stuff. One or the other. We, we can work on it. Yes, we do. We really do. Isn't his name Peter? Yes, Peter Rabbit. Yes. <laughs> Bye, Janine. <coughs> Talk later, Paula. I've got to go make tacos now. <laughs> All right. I'm going to end it as soon as I get this glued together because my fingers are yucky. She might be stuck. I know, Cindy. I know. I said I was going to have to take your cue. It won't work. <laughs> oh, Lord. Bye, guys. Talk to you soon, Lindy. Have a good time. Bye, Jill. Thank you for coming on today. Thank you, Paula. It. So make sure you guys check out the, the hop. It's going to start with the traveling crafter, Angela. And then my video will post on the 14th. So please, um, if you're not doing anything and you enjoy hops, hop on over to everyone's channel. And Angela will give you the schedule and all that good stuff and we'll have some fun. So there's one of Sean's Halloween. You guys, thank you so much for joining us. Um, I want to wish everybody a happy Easter from Sean and I. We are going to dinner with um, Tristan 
because for some reason he thought he had to turn 23 and celebrate another birthday. So, if I see you guys in the morning, that would be great. If not, enjoy your family and the holiday, and we will chat again real soon. We love you all. Bye, everyone.